Hi, this is a sneak peek of my Minecraft World Beta 1.0. And is Ollie Christensen. This is my underground like electronic system where all the electronics for the uh, for the day and night switch it on and off. This is just inside the town hall. I haven't completely finished. As I said, it's, t it's still beta. On top, there's a daylight, daylight sensor, which is done to a... just going to break it. To a, As you see, it opposite the signal when you use a, one of those, opposite the, the signal. Uh, so it gives the opposite of what time... So if it's day, it gives out power but you, you don't want it to be light and that's uh this is this redstone torch as if it's uh, day or night and if it's uh, the royal visit is near they that goes on um and it took it's so much uh wiring which went into that and now i'm going to show you my swimming pool Too long, it's all the way on the edge. Yeah, GT a bit. Now I'm just going around the edge. This is where the cashier just to the right. That's the men's changing room. The women's changing room. The men's changing room. Which one to go in? Hard choice. Women's changing room. Go around the corner and go to the swimming pool. Now it does have a switch to turn all the lights off. All the lights do turn off, but. You can see I've got night vision on if you look there where my mouse is. Uh, it does work really well. It took loads of time to do all of, all of it. The redstone torch above is just to show, like, um, just like, so you know where it is. And that's all it looks like outside the window. I don't know how chicken managed to get in. Just spawned there randomly. Just walking out. This redstone is uh, for the person who works there to open and shut the thing, open and shut the doors to the swimming pool. It's a public swimming pool. And this took a long time to make. It's a, it's still. This doesn't really work that well yet. It's like a post office. So if I get a minecart, usually I use a, a one of a a thing in it, a um, chest in it, so you just knock it off, and then goes to the place, the main post office. I, I did a, the system which doesn't really work at the moment, but I'm gonna try and redo it. It's a bit of a fail. So yeah, just riding along. A lot and a lot of work went into all of that. And just get off that. You want, you just go up the steps to get up there. Obviously, I'm cheating about going up. And it arrives up there. Now, if it was a mine, uh, a mine chest, you could just collect it, and then if you put it in water. But the thing about if you put it in water is that it take it can despawn. So what I'm thinking about doing is, uh, um changing that into a, a rail so I can get the uh, minecart to go down instead of uh, so it won't despawn it'll do it a lot quicker here's my moment of fame dun 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 So it's quite a long way underneath, and then you come to the front of the castle, which isn't finished off yet. Still haven't finished the top. Now I just cut this when I was making it, but it's meant to be like this. Now I I forgot how to um how to get through properly, so I kept trying by doing that, and then it wouldn't open for me. So I then eventually found out that if you stand on it and wait, which took me a while to find out, if you stand on it and wait for it to open, then you run, you can then go through. 
But the only problem is I can't go back in, so I'm going to have to fly over and go in through one of the gaps inside. I put TNT because the whole thing is underneath is completely ridden with as much TNT like as an emergency, like if someone tries to come in. Here, like testing is a testing lab with brewing stands, chest. Here's if they want to like test fireworks or stuff. They can, they can, they've got a high space, which is inside, which is using one of the towers. Here's my prison. This is for like really bad, the really bad beds. But it goes up to better, but not so good. Then really bad. And then at the very top, there's a, which is I'm just going to skip to now. There's a really, like, for people who are really bad, they, they've got a big room, but they, they stay there, like, if it's the people who are staying there for the rest of their life. They're tiny. Some of them are quite big. Some of these are, like, midget, like, really small. So just go back down. I made a system so they can't get out. Wait, when I get to the bottom, I'll show you. So just lock all the doors behind me. Wait, if I go back. So that you can lock all the doors behind you. And that's locked, so they can't get out. And I'm going to show you my paintings room. Which, you go through here, there's a secret hidden entrance. As you can see, it's completely ridden of TNT. There's like a self-destruct mechanism. So if it's being attacked and they want to get out, and then they get in and put it up. Here's where they sleep if they have to like escape. It's got a whole layer of bed bedrock, so they won't get blown up. Then they've got a big bed, and then the end is where the king and queen sleeps. And then it just goes on for a while down there. Then when you go back up. And yeah, just going. Then this is where the post is meant to arrive, but the system doesn't really work that well. I'm gonna try and revise it and make it better. Here is where the king's like sort of area is. Here is where the chapel is, but I had to break the floor because I was sorting out to make sure the. It wasn't an explosive. Um, oh, when you turn that off, it turns off all the lights as well, which is pretty cool. That's the king and queen's bed. Go there, that's the bathroom. That's the bath. And there's a shower, which just gets the water flowing down. There's a nursery and an animal farm up here, so here's the animal farm. Pretty cool. And then in here is, yeah, wait, yeah, no. Nah. There is a nursery, so you should just turn it off. I, I made the pictures around the edge, sort of like child themed, so. It's like that, when you pull the lever, it also opens, it turns the lights on and opens the door. Which I did all in one. Then in here there's a farm for food. And here there's some more farm for farming for food. And in here there is a shooting range, which basically what you have to do is you just have to aim for the very middle. You see it's right there in the middle. There's a chest with the bow and arrow if you want to practice. That's if you're a legend, then it's the easy and easier ones. There's the lookout station, which you can look out at you here, here you can look out and you can fire from these the in the corners. If you're being attacked, you can go down here and then fight. If they manage to break through the, the main wall. Here there's some chests. A chest with armor. A chest and this one gets broken by mistake.
in here there's the kitchen, any really simple kitchen, and here's the dining hall with the tables and the the red seats, the like the king seat. Yeah, and here's the king's throne again, and here's the switch with the. Um, the king's uh, going to arrive in town, it goes all the way to the uh, town where it is. Just gonna walk out. Opens. Here's a bell, you probably won't be able to hear it on this uh, recording, but if you press that, a doorbell rings. It's gonna show you around the outside and also show you the inside of the, the prison at the top. There's a lookout station uh, for the guards. It's just. So here's so they can look out to see if the prisoners manage to escape or anything, and they can shoot with bow and arrows or and things like that. Now I'm just going to show you what it looks like around the edges. Yeah, I'll be doing more sort of gaming videos, and there's the only there's the beta. If you've got any questions about any other things, just leave it in the comment section below and I'll answer with it and thank you for watching this video I'll be doing many more soon